Hey, what is going on, guys? It is Loxar Gaming here, and today I am going to show you how to do an overlay using Stream at Pro. I'm, I gotta close out of a lot of this stuff. I don't even, I don't even know why I got. Oh, uh, let's. Wait. Oh, I got confused there. So. Okay, so in order to do this, what I used to use this one that you see on the screen for OBS, but now I have switched to the OBS Studio, which I find a lot easier to actually do all of this stuff that I'm going to do. So basically, what you're going to want to do is well, first of all, here, let's close out of this. Close out of this. Okay, you're going to want to go. Um, let's get rid of that. <laughs> uh, don't need that. Um, what you're going to want to do is... Actually, we'll keep this for now. Go to the Stream Pro website. And what we'll do, we'll create a new overlay. We'll call it... Whatever. And I go 1920 by one. 180 or 10,000 or 1,080 and yeah so create overlay um, there we go so what you're going to do you can either go with a theme or make your own the one that I use is this one right here or the, the one that I'm going to be using I haven't really actually used it yet but you got these ones you for like you can yeah there's just these are all the ones I have so far and yeah so let's just go with I don't know Minecraft doesn't really matter what one we use I'm not using it it's just for the tutorial so here you go so current adventure if you don't want that on the screen you just click on it and click remove and for custom text, I'm not sure how to get rid of it, but here's one way you can do is just put it back so it's hidden. Or if you want, you can keep it and then put whatever. Then you can go to font settings, make it bigger. Better make this bigger so it's bigger. We'll, we'll move it down and boom and yeah basically that's all you gotta do so the part you really want to know is how to get it onto your OBS so you're gonna need a plugin for OBS which I forget how I did it but it is whoops okay it's browse yeah, browser source plugin for OBS. So you go here. Um, I I can't remember what one I. I think it might have been this one. It's one of these. I can't. Oh no, it was, it's one of these two. Uh, I think I I think I went with this one. And then uh, yeah, so you install it. You go to program files times 86 OBS and then plugins and then you put it in there and boom you're done. So now that you would have that, here what we're gonna do is turn this off right quick and then we're gonna go to add. We're gonna go browser source, call it whatever, because whatever. Okay. Now you're gonna want to change it to what you put as the thing on the website so 1920 by 1080 click oh wait no 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 before you click OK you want to copy and paste the URL that you got I think this is for my other ones but you're I forgot to mention this you're gonna wanna launch it and then you're gonna wanna copy and copy this and then you're gonna wanna paste it here and then boom OK now it should pop up there it is loading in and boom 
Now, what some people, even me, that I had trouble with, I found this out when I switched over to Studios, because I could not figure out how to do it on this one right here that I'm recording with, is how to pop it up. So, in order to do it, what you do is you right-click on the source that you put it as, go to full screen projector source, display, and then what you're going to want to do, I click control alt tab and then I'll open up Minecraft and then you can look at there and then yeah. And easy as that. You're sitting there, you can live stream and then what you can do is go like this, type hi, and then you, whoops, wrong one, and then boom, you'll see it right there while you're playing the game, and yeah, so that's all you gotta really do, um, it's easy as that, I didn't know that, but there, I wouldn't have even found this out if I didn't switch over to a studio, because I was having quality problems with my videos on one of my channels, so, yeah, so, yeah, I figured this out for switching. I don't, there's probably a way you can hide this. Um, I'm not really sure, but wait. Maybe not. Wait. Oh, that's what that does. <laughs> I've never clicked on that before. Um, there's probably a way you could do it. No. Yeah, but anyways, you guys probably might know, might not, I don't know. If if you really want to, you can search it up. I might later on. Oh, there it goes. It's not popping up now. And yeah, that's it. I hope you I hope this got helped you out a lot. I hope this helped you guys out a lot. And oh yeah. What you're gonna wanna do if you I forgot to mention this earlier. Um, you can go to here, get rid of that. Oh, wait. Oh, I'm on the wrong one, that's why. You can go to Test Widget. Oh. Uh, and yeah, it just plays music, and that just lets you know someone, or and it pops up that someone followed you or whatever. So yeah, that's all you gotta do. Hope this helped you guys out a lot, and I hope you guys enjoyed. And one thing I want to mention before this video ends, um, I was checking, I went to check out the comments for one of my videos, and I noticed that it was disabled. I have no idea why it's disabled. I go into my settings, and it says that they're enabled. Um, go, look, uh, I gotta go to my channel there, this one. I... Yeah, like here, we'll click on this one, and co comments currently unavailable. I have no idea why it's doing that. Um, my settings should. I'm gonna edit. Hey, what is? I'm gonna edit. You go to events. Look, allow comments. I have no idea why it's not showing allowing comments. So. Yeah, I tried searching it up a little bit, couldn't figure it out, but if you guys know how to fix it, oh wait, you won't be able, you probably won't be able to comment, so, well, you could actually, if you wanted, if you know, you could go to my, yeah, you can go to one of these two channels, I said leave, just, there. You could go to either my Laxar Gaming or Laxar Gaming Minecraft and more, and then comment on one of my videos on these channels, and just just tell me if you know how to fix it. So, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see you guys in the next video.